Hi right, guys, welcome back to another episode of Boy Things Podcast. I do thank you for watching. Thank you so much for joining. We're almost at our season finale. We almost reached 10 episodes. I can't believe it. The season just started. I feel like we, 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 we've covered a lot, right? Um, so you can look out for the season finale next week. Well, the other week. And um, yes, yeah, so, you know, thank you so much for the support. I'm grateful as per usual. Remember, my radio show is every Tuesday night, 8 to 11 o'clock on Newstart 93 FM. Follow my socials. I'll put them in, in the description box. Um, once again, we're here by Catalyst Perfect 10 Med Spa, located at shop number 19 inside the Ligani Post Mall. Again, I feel like I couldn't know all the products and services that they do offer by now because I list them out every single week. However, they do have new new packages um so they are offering our house calls for facials wax and foot detox easy 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 things and they have their birthday packages i'm always read two every week you know them have the breast and butt enhancement plus you know vaginal steam for twelve thousand. them have lunchtime facials and foot detox for ten thousand. them have hair restoration packages fat reduction packages cellulite treatments vaginal rejuvenation packages so it's a whole lot um, so you can just call them, or if it's not your birthday, you can tell them to say birthday and get it. You understand? Yeah. Um, and also, they have 30% off all cellulite treatments and fat reduction procedures. And $4,500 for a foot detox and for paraffin waxing. You know, foot detox, it, 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 all of our body, we, we, all a bag of drinking and you know, food that we eat and things, it can take out all of that. All right? Also, this is the thing here when I always see me with someone I ask me where I get it from. It's from Vape Shop JA, right? And it's a disposable vape. See the little box here? Yeah. yeah. Amazon. So it gives you, I think, I think 400 pulls, Martin. So you go, 400. Yeah. So 400 pulls, then it done. Trust me, I live by these. If you know me personally, you, you're going to always see me vaping. Um, you know, this is the nicotine flavor, you know, with mint and all of that. Um, so it can reduce you from smoking actual cigarettes. Cool. And they have mango, um, the, this mental one. They have lychee, cool mint, and all of that. And also, they have the refillable vapes. Not that I want them where, you, yeah, yeah, have a look at refill thing, put it in there that lasts longer. And they have a whole variety of flavors uh, French vanilla, they have kiwi, watermelon candy, dragon fruit, strawberries, peaches, all of that. You understand? And also, I want to give a shout out. Um, to an upcoming YouTuber by the name of Cool Down by Donna. So I'm going to try and give at least one YouTuber a shout out every single week. So I'll put her link in the description box as well. She lives in Cayman Islands, but you know, she's, you know, sharing in the island as well, you know, lifestyle things and such. You understand? Why my phone is not on silent? <laughs> you understand what I'm say? Right. So, you know, big up on yourself. We have a guest here. Um, my bridging, my brother. Co-worker, we know when we used to keep parties and all these things, right? Mr. Adir, also known as Nino, uh, pro pro small producer, promoter extraordinaire, by the way. He, you know, he keeps sons over. So, Triple Thursdays, sons they all boat in a foreign, sons all keep Alaska, Australia. I don't know, it's like this and next one I'm going to bring sons go. Right? So, Nino, introduce yourself, let them know where, they, where we can follow you and all of that. I uh, don't know, Karim already said the most I already. But can you follow up on Instagram at Nina underscore TNS? <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, so, you know, as I've said before, a lot of you guys know Nino from his social media. Shanzi's boyfriend. I don't know, I don't know him. You know, by many different ways, um, his events, Bully Pono that is watching this right now, have been at least one of his events. Africa, events right. before. Most. Most. At least a sons. At least a sons. Estate. Something. Estate. Something. <laughs> um, you know, he's been doing this for a long, long time. When I started doing promotion, he was already. Um, what the Thursday or was a Wednesday by um, Friday, backward? Yeah. Salt so, Lounge. Salt Lounge Fridays. Yeah. Jesus have his mercy. But I tell you a story about that. That's what we meet them accident, by the way. <laughs> yeah. Um, so Nino is here. And um, I mean, you know, again, I've known him for many years. And I know of his story. He has spoken about it a couple of times on his social media platforms. Um, yes, you know, when I see the flash of things now, and I see all of that and his successes, and, you know, it is admirable. You know, um, however, there is a backstory to all of this. Before you just said. Yeah, and I, I've, I've heard it multiple times, and I think that it was very inspiring. So I wanted him to be here 
uh, just to kind of give you guys, you know, an insight or, you know, look at motivation because I always know our motivation. You understand? So, Nino, how long now you've been doing events? I do events from about... Oh, seven years? Eight years? Oh, seven, eight years. Yeah. yeah. I signed this about... Six. About six. Yeah. I'm start about a year or two before signs so about six. About seven, eight. All right. And uh, why you chose promotion? Because I know you grew up in a church. <laughs> your, family, your parents are pastors, right? Yeah. Yes. So you grew up in a church. So how you move from a church boy uh, to a man with about 100 tattoo, right? To a party. <laughs> how did that happen? When it come to a party, though, come like I eat chicken with me. And mm. then we eat chicken with like, I always love party before, like even now, maybe that's why it's so natural and maybe that's why the party them grew up, all them grow so fast. I've been, I go, I always go road and people just, I always just say, yo, why you not keep something? And mm. yeah, so they're like, good man, until eventually, um, a brother named Alka, Alka used to be the manager for Quad. Mm. So Alka said, so like, oh, I'm so come at the, that's when, why name again? Uka Teresa? Uka Teresa, you used to be beating. Yeah man, you know Uka Teresa, you know things. You know things, yeah. So, me and my team, so ever did that care, I'm missing no Teresa. Mm. I have worked the next day, see, because them time they don't know, I still have work at them too. I have worked the next day, but that care, I'm missing no Teresa. So, being a so constant now, like them take notice, and I say, yo, also they got other party, where I keep out there with them, mm. and I see where people know, so them say, why not want to keep something, want to keep something at the club and try it and thing, mm. and, but that was still a challenge combo, you see me? So come so boom no one, no I lie. Try a one half party first. What part was that? Party name, Tatsa. Art of Life, Tatsa oh, and Boos. Yeah, but remember Tatsa first, and Boos. That's our first party. Yeah, I don't man. know, so people know for the tattoo and things, so. Yeah. But so here I go and Free tattoo and piercings all night for who want to come to the party. No big tattoo and thing, but it's coming. One. Was it successful? It never, we never lose, so. Okay. <laughs> but it was uh, not officer, yo, damn, nah, keep, but any idea, we never do really like, keep it. To make money, just to like, keep it because of the joy. Because see what I go on, we keep party, we want to see what I go on, we see what I go on. Right. Never pre like, say, yo, we actually do this and mm. then I start do this as a career. So that's, mm. after the fun night, do it, it go on good. And I say, what? Well, I'm saying, give you your next date, man. Do our next one, him. Um, Art of life again, but it was a different team. It wasn't that it was. I don't remember. It was something else. Mm. Anyway, that lead to the connection make and relationship make with we and Corey, the man. Corey Todd from Quad and Corey, Taboo so and all of that. We try a thing now, man. Soul Challenge. Mm. Series every Friday. Mm -hmm. I'll start that. And that Connect. Mm. Like, Connect Club Ram every Friday. And I say, yeah. You see me? So that keep now. Be the little fan base. We used to do a little thing, I would go over Fort Clarence every, every Sunday. Right. So you far out over there. It's a little there. Yeah. So mm -hmm. you just far out over there, drink some liquor, like a post up on my page. So you on the far out, we say I buy uh, some fish and everything. And the far out, come eat some food, free food for me. And just far out mm. and eat some food. We're going to own a buckler and it's vibe. I think it was a, uh, which holiday? A Labor Day? It was, was on me. Day. Yeah, man. A Labor Day. Definitely Labor Day. A labor yeah, yep, trust me. Yeah, mm -hmm. it was a labor day. I come up now, I was say, yo, it's so like a post it. Now I put up on the Sunday in the morning, say, yo, come on the beach Sunday. Mm -hmm. But I want to know what's so, yo, from like from the other week, we say, yo, this labor day, everybody forward by yourself, go just all up and thing. Mm -hmm. And about 600 people come up on the beach. And, and that was actually pretty so 400 old, right? people. No, it wasn't, no, that wasn't the party. Oh, that was just it's the, a link up right, to you, let's right, forward. Yeah. I was and then say, yo, a of people. Yeah, so my link, and then time we have Tiggy and to keep envy yeah. over, over, over privilege. Over privilege. Big up privilege. So right, we so. and them, so yo, on the far up on the beach, a labor day come all apart. Mm. And we said, no people come out. And we said, yeah, go, we we'll try a beach party mm. or something, man. you see me? And we they call it socks and sun. Because <laughs> 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 I don't know where I'm man, we are here. It's socks on the sun. <laughs> so yeah, 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 right? He listens so to yeah, the So yeah, so yo, yeah. we are call it socks and sun. you see me? I'd go so boom no and why into that? That's so good, dog. That's, that's for the sacks. I love the sand. Yeah. <laughs> I'll go so boom and sands. People then first link up and be a people park forward. I would say, oh, come and try this. I will do it the right way, you know. Mm -hmm. Put a cast to it. Thousand dollars for the ticket. You know, and that was pre-sold only. Pre right? Because I can only. recall. Let me tell you this. Yeah. At that moment, 
that same year of Suns, I was doing an event like three months after um, Sip Summer Dreams. Yeah. Right? And I can't forget it. My skull work for God's Suns, right? Yeah. <laughs> I remember everybody had scrambled for get ticket. Yeah. I mean, I said, no, man, I want this. Yeah. I remember the morning they would drive up and don't forget ticket in a car. I said, yo, this scam is <laughs> just because of, you know, it was authentic. Yeah. Cool. And I think um, the organic response from the patrons, I think that is what made And the place, and the venue was a, some of the nice, be- it's a wedding place. You know? yeah. It's a wedding backyard. Nice backyard. Um, it was like, pretty. Yeah, so man. Nice <laughs> and, this and, and like, we keep it and when Sansa are keeping, we tell you, they say, yo, like, about, I thought about 500 people are come at 400. And brother. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but then I'm going to say, be a care, come and be a care, come and be a people. And I say, People now stop forward on the past. Yeah. Now stop forward though, until they got Juan anyway. So they Juan, a Juan Juan yard was supposed to yard out cut this from. And brother, like the rest is just history. Like from that come and people like we are we are more than we didn't even expect. Right. Come and uh we say yo. Well, you could keep on the air again, because one woman get vexed and say, yo, no lock off this no car, people says, are coming in my house and yeah. Yeah. <laughs> But let me just ask so you though. So, 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 let me just backtrack this a little bit and kind of, um, you know, unpack it. Before it's about right. It. So then, when you started your first event, right? Um, you know, as I say, you have very conservative parents. Mm-hmm. But them don't see you always like, oh, well, you have a tattoo them long time and all these things. So I'm mm-hmm. kind of, you know, I would think that they would be understanding. But the conversation, you'd be like, yo, mommy and daddy, you know, say a party, me go keep. You also said that you were working. Mm-hmm. Where were you working at that moment? Work a wolf. Work a wolf. Mm-hmm. So when you tell them no, take a key party, were they you know like receptive of it to say yeah, definitely, or them were just like brother, this is not it. Why you can't go corporate? <laughs> my parents, them, I know them a pastor. If anybody meet my, if them walk coming here, so no, yeah, they realize say, oh me, just kind of yeah, yeah. easy and easy going. Mm-hmm. Them now go be the person that tell me so yo, no, don't do that. And them let me make my choices mm-hmm. if it. I might like, give me advice. Mm-hmm. So I go in my phone and say, yo, yeah, stop work. And this this me I do. Mm-hmm. Of course I don't know. Everybody, I said, I get mad man, dog, if you do that. And mm-hmm. if you good, good work, I want free. Right. And I say, yo. Everybody I gave them advice at the end of the day, me didn't know what me want for do. You see me? So it never reason that thing where the matter is to stop. Why I mean I keep parting? So mm-hmm. that no, that never argument never really never really happened. So then I heard on one of your lives, right? Where you were mm-hmm. talking about while working at 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 at, at WAF, or even before WAF, mm-hmm. right? How how was your upbringing? I mean, living on your own um, financially, were you surviving before WAF? Mm-hmm. Before, at WAF, WAF for the glory days that I went things died. Start nice. So before WAF, yeah. So we never really have no issue like that. We never perfect, but mm. yeah, get money, get money. We're good. WAF, yeah. WAF pay good enough. If I never wife would we keep party, I would have paid good enough. Nobody would we could have come on a party by the back line and shit. Exactly. So, so before wife, what happened? So like before wife, no, um, bam, bam, bam. One must start right from about 17. Mm. <laughs> I will come so boom, no one. Uh, about three years before wife. Mm. That had a really the roughest, roughest time. Like, um, we used to, oh, first we circle wife was a security. That is a sort of story. So that's what I was a security. Mm. Zin? I like. Don't know when you're a young youth, I pray, say, yo, I'm not doing a security work and thing. Mm. And then, what you don't know, my grandmother and auntie, them, they told me, my parents seem to move from Port Moore, live at St. Anne. I mean, you hate them, I say. So, yeah. Country life. That can't work for me. So, I come back at home, come live with my grandmother and my auntie, them, Zin? Yeah. All right. So, come, so boom, no one. Them is a no nonsense people. Like my parents are more lenient and mm. say, hey, make him find him thing, why I'm going to do Yeah, you have to go find something. You have to go find something. You have to go work, you have to chip in, you have to do something. Which is why. Yeah. And I really, them time they're younger, you say, oh, my dad, I say, what? Like, I really, really, I eat, put the drive in a home, stay in a home. So there's no fucking iron mm. in life. Everybody's constantly a move. You might now, where you want to know, but you have to do something. Mm. What makes sense? Fucks. See me, so, boom, leave my hand to them, man. For them, son, my auntie them son did that do security work, see me. So oh me for going like me a pretty boy. Like, yeah. <laughs> if I feed them son and them yeah. son have you, oh me for going like me a pretty yeah. boy and boy I want for this, boy for work. So we come so boom no one the apply for port security. Port security either work or what for them put you at airport. At airport, right. I know that. Well one got airport because one of my cousin at airport him there, my favorite cousin at yeah. airport one go in up. But guys say 
Boom, no more off. I'm just a God work out things, say, yo, more time, you, why you and God have a direction, but God move a steering with you. You might have the vision, but God has to which I mm-hmm. to go. I never go off. But would uh, level up from the work of uh, the security work I work from. Right. Then I have to do the security work and. We need to security, like security, I get what we get and them something. No. Or well, security, like you check. Well, like security pack, different. Like containers. You have the one who do the gate, but then I check no bag, like them, I check the. It's a whole different thing, like check scanning, like things that drive through the right. machine, make sure no contraband and. It's a whole lot more different than like now, my security works right. things. But it still, in the end of the day, I mean, what it means, I mean, I say, yo, security, whatever, whatever. But the ship needs to work on. Mm-hmm. I work on the ship and, like, some brother come out, like, they don't know the shift thing. So you have a three different shifts, so a shift just change. Mm-hmm. You know, security never reach an hour like before. So the shift just change, and some brother come up on the shift and I'm attacked. Like, I say, yo, dog, how much money you make last week? The man, I say, yo, you know what I say? 30 grand I make, and next one said, I oh, get a joke, that much hours a beat, we get about 60 grand. So I said to the man, I said, what, but fortnight, come here, that can't just say, yeah, yeah, yeah. Spark up, you know, I said, what, but fortnight, what, the fortnight, what, 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 for a week? Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's coming like, it's still like a shot as thing, but I said, yeah. <laughs> but anyway, I said, go for two, what, 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 yo, I said, make 60 grand a week, I said, 60 grand a week. I know, money that. And then, then, I said, security, the brother, my fortnight, pay about 20, 18 grand. <laughs> <laughs> and why am I do me? No, me can do easy, isn't it? Yeah. I'm brother. My brother named Philip Martin. Me and Philip used to walk from the wharf part of the wharf from used to work at the past. You know, the port more so that the part over there, so yeah, yeah. there's a two side of the wharf. The port, the, the toll side, and the part you got clear by. Mm. And over the bar side, over the part, you can go port more. Yeah, you can yeah. look over there and see them big shit there. So, so walk from there, so go up at the office, drop off for application and resume, like. Brother, every day I'm do it. I'm say, yo, I'm not stop doing this. I'm going to have to get that right here, mm. brother. You see me? Boom, boom, boom. Never stop to me get the call. So I'm say, come for your interview. See? I'm so boom now. So the place where I'm there apply for was the shipping association of Jamaica, SAJ. Mm-hmm. See? Go up there and thing and. With the interview with them, I said, all right, they need 150 um, Steve at work. That's what I apply for. And then I get through one white woman. Make sure I have to resign from the work I had before. Which is the port security Port security, right. Okay. So I can get it. Boom, boom, boom. Resign. See, so I have to resign first. Okay. So, so you res- resign, yeah. I resign because I'm supposed to start training like... So work out one month, get the, make sure you post it to the, the two weeks notice. So yeah, work the two uh, weeks and yeah. all of that after the interview. So I wait for my um my car now for come to start training. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. Resign. There they are wait for the car now. No call. You see me? My regime Philip gets film call. I mean, I said, yeah. nah, what the I said, oh, when you start training and thing, but because I'm done, tell me get the work, I just wait for the training. But they said, what, 150? What am I doing? I'm training it by batch. Batches, right. So them training by um, batch of was four. We break down whatever it takes. Four and 150, that's about a uh, couple of people. Something and like, whatever it is. It's like 30, <laughs> that's like what? 30 per person or some shit like that. Something. Yeah. yeah. You get 30, right? Yeah, so like something like that. Must have five me getting a match. I don't know. I don't know nothing about match. I don't ask. 37 point, right. So, so 37, like, 38 per so batch. So my average right. didn't get kind of the first 100. Right about why they reach 100. Like, why wow, the reason why they even start to cancel so much people is because they've got a big contract. But the contract, go, the people shipping line go pull out. Mm. So you know, so who we done with the training, them safe. Mm-hmm. But me at the last, like, right, I mean, at the last, last batch of, at, at 30 for start training. I must say, yo, I have to go put your pants. Stand by. So I'm left work now, you know, right? For no reason, because I know your work. <laughs> so I'm left for work already, you know. So I'm going to come to the boom now, I say, John, what? I'm going to done telling my auntie, my mama, my grandma, you know, the fuck crazy day at work. Or you go to school, but you make sure you say, yo. You're doing something. You have to do something. You're right. Boom, boom, boom now. Long and short. That. Now I work now, so. End up, uh, I'm a cousin, I'm a mechanic. He ended up start work a superior auto parts. He say, oh, dog. I don't know so like four cousins away. See him, almost the same age as boy. Right. So, you know so what how said? long you, you were without a job um, after you resigned? After I resigned, about a year. About a year. 
So you're not contributing nothing. You're not making any money. A year after my left was a great. That's a year. That's not, that's not possible. I'm not, it wasn't a year. But a couple months. But a couple months. So you were making no there. income, nothing. No income, nothing at all. Boom. Superior my reach. They are superior in our work. As a mechanic? No. Like, they had a used parts place. But start out as just a person who, like, we don't know not born up. We don't know not born yet. <laughs> them ten. <laughs> but them say, yo, all right, more of them things are store over there, so. Yeah. Make sure them store over there, so. That my brother got this. So I start put the parts, them store them. But as a youth, brother, <laughs> I always observe. That's what I observe the man in conversation. I forget no more on the work. Yeah. Observe. So I start learning the parts, them. Move from that, come know the parts. I'm like, I walk, I go in, I'm like, yeah, customer asks the manager with the name Ruan at the time. So, hey, Ruan, go on this way, way, way. By the time Ruan for you to look, so me fight and bring Ruan. So, Ruan start knowing so I'm not. But just like, they fuck around, I move parts, isn't yeah. it? So, I start learning the thing, the man. So, them say, all right, here I go on, come be a sales rep. So, I start be a sales rep, I start sell the thing, the man, bring them around. Mm. Stop do that. It's easier than work, it's hard work. I mean, I do. I yeah. move, I still work, be every pass. Because I move, move, move a bag, if I have a hundred engine for move, and I do a business, that mm. I move engine and all that type of thing. All right, boom. That's what you are, you see me? Um, <laughs> can't about it. Anyway, long as I them start, say, yo, they get fire from superior, because they say, yo, you know, also. I don't know what I'm talking about. I wasn't hustling <laughs> nothing. Yeah, disclaimer. Disclaimer. <laughs> disclaimer. I, I don't know about the hustling. I was not hustling that thing, right? So them fire. <laughs> but them fire me because them some are hustling. Them never catch me. I don't know about them. Some people that come to them and say, yo, me, I do this to me. So how that. long were you a sales rep for? What a year. A oh. year. What a year. I'm there from, there from 2017. This I can't remember that timeline. Like, easy, like 2007. Oh, like about 2005. Not about 2007. Yeah, 2007. 2007. Right. 2007. Come on, boy, they've been a long time, man. Yeah, 2007. Yeah. Yeah. So then you got fired from Supreme, and then what happened after? From Supreme Auto Pass, and then now, <laughs> my auntie them up to I mean, book a girl, why I'm working at Supreme Auto Pass. And she comes to so boom and she live and she was CV. So me and the girl live together and them thing. I left my yard up to one. And I live in a CV. And I live in a CV, guy. You see me? Man can lead with a straight sometimes. I don't know, like, so yo. Hey, the man said like, she good, she the cool, and I'm not, I'm not a person like, I'm not going to read, so I'm not going to judge about the way you come. Yeah. I'm a cool, I'm not good, I'm not there. I'm not there, you know, you see me? Who's the work as superior you now? My brother, that's how you know things get rough. As, I'm not right now. It's not anti them, yeah, and you don't know a different feel when you're there. On, although, me, our people never show me the bad feel, but you yeah. don't know, and you're family, you're still. Right, and different now, yeah. And you're a man now, you can't have someone there. So, the knowledge I have now with auto parts now, you know, so if you, if you even now you come on Agri Park Road, a beer auto parts place, they come auto parts. So I come so boom. You know, so yo. I learn, I learn with parts, so I start, start from three miles. I never forget that from three miles. I walk at the first auto parts place, so I'm three miles. I ask if they need nobody for, um, they need no worker, tell them, what do you say no? Hold walk on. from three miles. So you walked from three miles just going to random places? That's right. Hey, for you know, for you know, you sell car parts, I got to turn in there. Because right. I don't know the know some I have now. And, you see me? So mm -hmm. I try to just strike if I can work same time, I got feel it. And then there's superior auto parts, I was on the big car parts place. So, they sell under parts, are, they're supposed to, mm -hmm. you see me? All right, so, from three miles. Three miles to Agri Park, if I couldn't go out there. From three miles to half a tree. <laughs> you know what? That wasn't the intention. Like, let's yeah. walk until yeah. like, I reach. I'm a fan. Yeah, Nelson Mandela. Until I'm only walking. That, you know? <laughs> Bro, that's, that's a lot of walking. Me yeah, can't walk from right to go down stairs. Right I'm three miles. Yeah. Let me reach Waltham. And yeah. then I say, all right, walk past Waltham. You don't need to walk past Superior you now. Walk past Superior. You know? Go up. I'm going to reach a bird. Bird today. So. I'm going to go all them places until I end up with so far to me. I said, you don't reach a half a tree. But then I say, walk half a tree and then I'm going to taxi. Go back a tree while I'm going to see me back. Which I'm going to go from. But at the end of the day, I still walk. Because I know, I say, yo. You needed a job. You need a job. But was this just and a one time walk thing or you did it um, more than once? I do it one time. Mm -hmm. did one day, I'm You never get a job. I never can. Eh? <laughs> so you just drop off resume. Drop off resume. So, so I write, write the resume them time that I already type it. Um, but because so I'm telling you all the times, I'm very visual. You know, some of us, I imagine you're walking <laughs> at the hats on a sweat, look a bit of wipe your sweat with a little kerchief. Because them times we always have a kerchief. I remember I say, I look decent, so I long teeth. Yeah. I don't sleep straight ever. Exactly. So you know, you're sweat. What do you know, man? I never in a hat. <laughs> <laughs> wow, um, that's brother, crazy. Do you think and 
Nothing about me to that. Boom. All right. Try right. Look to the green every day, right? Them other places, they go for a couple of interview, but nothing about Nothing right. happened. And long, long, long as that, the quickest work to get, when I show this to the same to this day, is security work. It's one work I'm not easy to forget. Mm -hmm. When you have sense, you must handle a security, security work. Yep. Boom again. Plus, yeah, security work. Zin. Security work comes, so boom, no one. And this never flash like. Poor I security. Want. Poor security. Security work was like, it's the top tier security work. Right. They can't let somebody even know what you're doing. It's a real security work. Push down the thing for letting the car them to other place. Still on another security or real security work. No. So was it like a business complex? Yeah, um yes. them the base me at this place called Zoma. You know, might know Zoma. Them do my brother says some learn enough thing that them bring like once like the check leaf and like even your birth certificate paper. You know and Zoma, thing um Davian, yes? Yeah. yeah, okay. Mm. So Zoma internet, so that's what I did there at the security work, isn't it? Mm. One time I say I'm a virgin from church, this coming, you know what I mean? I said, I feel like, oh, you know that? We never check in that security unit. My message, you know what I mean? I'm drive coming, you know what I mean? I said, you know what I mean? But no, no, still, I do me always preach, say, yo, I can't beg him. I don't want to beg him. I don't want to beg no friend for nothing. So better I know what I mean? No matter how me might feel, when the fight night come get my pay, me feel better the best feeling I might, and come and get my own money. But then I can imagine, um, you know, as a human being, cool, um, you know, all of us have emotions and stuff like that. I can just imagine, Zero Virgin from church, long time, maybe not even see me in a long time. And yes. here you are, this person driving in, and you're the person lifting up the things to let you yeah. in. I cannot imagine how. No, how but I feel no way. I never said, it must be too glad for some of you guys. But in a man, I say, if I don't know, man, I'm on pride, man, I say, John, I'll stay. So then you come and come see me on this one. I do my thing, see me. What I really get, and this is like the lowest, lowest part, brother, like. My day after, I know what it is. My day after is a Saturday that day, that week day. You see me? The supervisor, whoever she want to be. Hmm. She called me the Friday night and said, Yo, Mr. Adair, you need to come to work tomorrow because Kareem can't make it. Mm -hmm. So you need to, you need, you need to come full fill in. I said, Yo, yeah, my day after, I'm She said, You either come or you don't want to work, or you have to find a music. Trick thing that you do you want to work or you, you don't want to work or not. Like, you're not even asking me if I'm available. You're telling you me for me? coming, you know. You got a right up. Why not call your mother or your father for come work, miss? But don't, but can't come and have church. You got a right up and yeah. you're really, really, I mean, I say. I don't have nothing planned, but you don't have one idea if you want an idea. Right. You see me? I'm saying, all right, I'm going. Come on, man, and a man in shift to me. Yet, <laughs> up to this day, I'm still not like wake up early. Mm. Boom. Wake up early. See you to downtown, you see me? Because I'm dead up on Orange Street, you see him? Cross from Orange Villa. I would even know you. <laughs> right, cross from <laughs> Orange Villa, you see him? Yeah. I yeah, walk from town, so I walk up there. You don't know how to save as much money. Because I can bus go up there, but they like. No, I'm thinking about it, I would never do that. No, when I walk so far enough. But yeah. them time, I walk to come like I knock me that. You yeah. see me? So, like, I walk from town, or go up to go up Zoma, you see me? But, um, what is the name again? We try to try to keep it. What is the name again, man? I'm Garrison, let me wipe me. Martin, see Martin, he was like, I don't know what that is. What is the name again? Some cap. You know, how you forget that? That name, but anyway, I'm going to reach, I'm going to almost reach Zoma. Like, the, before it's Zoma, I have a Jewish church, a Jewish, um, cemetery. You see me? A Jewish cemetery. I have like a road before I reach. I'm, if I have a fire station up the road more to for myself. So Zin, yeah, I walk I have my ever my love music long time. So I have my now I'm me ever have my iPad. I know iPad, I'm MP3 player. Right. <laughs> yeah, store have, music pad. With your big um with a headphone and my ears. Yeah, I can't hear nothing I'm gonna have on that. And this man in a mind say, nobody put on a music man, just go out, go here, go. I mean I walk. Brother walk, brother ride up behind me and say, yo. <laughs> when I look for you, you say, yo, I look, I'm going mm. to name you, and you can't, you yeah. don't know how we are. I'm a friend, sir. So I'm saying, yo, I'm saying, yo, I'm saying, yo, you know me, I show it to you. So I look around now, I'm saying, yo, by the time I say that now, I'm there near the chat, you know, you see me? I'm on a bicycle, like, I'm have a food box, but I'm going into the food box, and I'm coming to the boom, and so your door running, you know? You see me, and I say, boom, 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 I just jam, because I said, I'm Saturday, so I'm driving a pay. I get paid during Friday night, so I'm Saturday morning, the pay, there, there. Yes, so I'm driving yeah, a pay at home before me even come. Start work. walk direct, I might pay it. 
you know, your jeans have a little pocket here, so. Yeah. So I stuff up everything in my little pocket this already, because I'm ever, ever paranoid from a long time. So I'm going to search him, I'm not going to feel like this, so you know? Yep. I'm just stuffed the whole money in this area, and I say, yo, if you just get paid, I'm going to grab me. Is it me? I'm going to say, yo, where you have for me, Mr. Brother? I'm going to have nothing for me. I work me, I do. Is it me? I'm going to say, Brother, you must have something for me, you know, man. say, yo, where your phone? Then time, I'm going to go, all, all, scratch up, no, okay, my brother. Nokia all, Nokia was the phone them time, they kind of like it, have iPhone and yeah. them, but my Nokia did all. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you see me? So I was like, oh, it's got your Nokia, and the man I said, yo, give me that. I like, when he said, give me that, I like, me know what I put that, like, me if it's a trigger box or something, man, me I say, you know, so the man I had them fuck, I'm like, what the fuck am I going to do with him? Can't, can't, what am I going to do with that phone here, you see me? Mm. So like, I start, I like, before, I look on the gun, like, the gun, like, literally, them face first, and man, the two boss start come, like, the sun start come up. So like the coast of us, them walk out on the start running. Put up the gun back. So, and find the gun, same, but it's up on the bicycle and so, you see me? So, he must say, yo, you have a road beside the cemetery. He must say, yo, go on another road there. And I look on that road there, grass, I grew up on that road there. So, you know, so the car I drive once upon a blood clot regular, you see me? So, I say, yeah. Look up the road, look upon him, upon the bicycle. <laughs> I look around the road and I tell me if I go. So I come to one of my two cars, brother, I'm here. I come to one of my two cars, you see me? And the man, by the time I took off, I start running across the next side of the road and run back across. And the camera said, Yo, if I'm going to shoot, I'm going to catch me zigzagging. Yeah. Like, I saw me, I run up this road. You know. By the time I never look back behind me, I'm not at all. Because I said, like, Look, listen for you, you're not at all. By the time I find which are the, um, the fire brigade station now, where they're near this up, that's how I first look back. Most of the women look back now, the man is sitting on the bicycle seat, on the bicycle seat, and the man is like, you really run. <laughs> and I start bar with him, I say, yo, the man is like, try to me, and we, we, we. and the people them come, so boom, now, like the fire, fire them come out, and I see the people them start come out, ride off, and back where I come from, you see me? Boom, now, and the fire station, the, the station, they cross the road from, you see me? Mm. Come, so boom, now, and Go around and change the room was home up, put on. So on, you still went to work after that? Yeah, I forgot I worked here. <laughs> so I come so boom. You need to work on. Put on, put on my uniform, my security uniform. Reach up at the office now. A woman I tell me, I got asked me, say. Why are you late? Late? What am I doing here? The same way that called you to come in? Yeah. So I say, what do you mean? He said, near the half. I said, what do you mean? Again, he said, what do you ask me? He said, you come and tell me to come and work. He said, me? You know, tell me to come and work. But if I remember what the fuck, I said, I'm going to that woman's name. Like, she said, yo, no more than she replaced me with someone with two other person going to come watch a faithful car. Right, I'm telling you, it's another show. But she can't tell me that now because she can't tell the wrong no more because in my idea, she's not the boss. It's a, it's a, a supervisor for that. Um, um, shift or something. Supervisor for that, because and a Zoma security is like a security company, Zoma IR security company. Okay, so she's, okay. She just had a supervisor for that base, whatever them said me. Bro, mm. you see me? So she just said, yo. So she don't want to turn around, so she want to look like you're coming here on your day. Like, me not for coming. I mean, I said, yo. I mean, I said, Father, I got to wear this. <laughs> but like, God. me never feel, all of the money just carry me and think, me never really feel like, me I give, for give up or feel like down and hurt. But when I realize, I you know this woman tell me, say, yo, what may I do here? I'm going to change the room now, I say, God, I'm going to deserve this. My mom was dead <laughs> because of this. <laughs> My mom was dead because I have to do the right thing. You see me? The woman who tell me, ask me, what I come here for? I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I'm going to change the room. You see me? I say, no, sir. I can't, I'm not, not wicked. I'm not doing nobody nothing. I'm going to say, oh, I'm going to do my struggle. I'm still happy for anybody. I say, I don't know. What the fuck I'm going to do with them struggle? You see me? I'm going to say, Father God, so, Father God, I don't know if I try to fix things, brother. And this happened, this was the same Saturday. And it's like about two years after they applied for work and get you, you know. <laughs> and I went on the call for the interview. So, the Saturday, so the Saturday, you know, when the man almost had me two years later, and said, so the Monday morning, when I'm still at work at the same work, bright and early, there's a call from WAF. This is Mr. Adair. I said, Yeah, are you still interested in the work? Do you still do it? Right now. I'm so, what? Brother, I told my happy brothers. When I don't, 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 don't call it, I just take off my clothes back. 
and let's go back through the gate there and go straight back and see you there. <laughs> Come here, I say, I say, Father God, tell me, tell me, thanks, God. I say, yo, my body, nobody can't really tell me nothing. I always say. Oh, God, because I tell you, say, yo, so when God, to all my poor, my heart, I tell you the truth. When I say, yo, the woman, when I change up my clothes back, I say, I'm almost dead. And I say, yo, Father God, you have to do something. Mm. This can't continue so for me, because I mean, I say, what am I doing to deserve this? Mm. The Monday, the very Monday. He yeah, just never bother to show up to work. I get the call. I mean, I go, back, I go back at which work. Yeah. I mean, say, yeah, them to come for your, them to, all right, let's come back in for your refreshers interview. I'm come back in. You see me? He even get your next before me even go there. So I'm like, people who know, say, yo, God is real and God is good seeing me. You see me? When we open the first interviews in, we need two recommendations plus resume or whatever. We get a recommendation from a GAP. And the next one for pasta, right? Pasta live on Sundown Avenue. I'm gonna live on more lines in time. They reach a half, half a tree, so I'm gonna pass Sundown already, isn't it? And I said, go back to the recommendation, and let's go for the interview. And one man said, you what? He said, if you don't go for that recommendation, eh, and never get that right. Mm. So I'm gonna jump up on the taxi, go back to Sun, got a pick up, pick up into it, get from pasta, and then go straight out for the interview. Up. So I'm gonna go for the interview, I'm gonna go and pull the Letter, Miss Reynolds, for the letter and see the pastor recommend me. He said, Pastor, call where you know him from? I said, The church I grew up in a rate. The woman who came home, I could tell her, I said, I ate big, I get that right <laughs> You see what life got? I, 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 I always tell people, you know, and that's why I always tell myself to live good with the people too, you know, because at the end of the day, right, number one, it's really, I'm not going to say that's why you get the job, but that's really why you get the job. Mm -hmm. You understand what I mean? I say, mm -hmm. If that person maybe never recommended you, maybe you wouldn't even get the job in the first place. Maybe you wouldn't even reach us in the first place. We never know if I get the, the job, but we exactly. know say we exactly. get the job because, because of, of that the recommendation. recommendation. How far we going now, Martin? Half an hour? 36. All right, so we're going to take a quick, quick break. All right, so we had to take a little break. Um, so we're back again. And you're hearing the story from Nino himself um, from walking Wally Pamels. <laughs> walking three miles. Walking <laughs> <laughs> three miles. <laughs> You know, handing out resumes to almost getting robbed on his way to work to, you know, being jobless and all of that to now being a superstar, basically. You know what I'm saying? I, I know and well, in a lot of our eyes, you know, you are doing very well. So you have to come in people, you know. I always tell people this, and you have to give people flowers while they're alive. Because I want to wait till them sick and dead and they say, boy, your mama, they rate him drive. No, you know what I'm saying? All right, so then you got the job at WAF, but I just kind of just want to go in a little bit of something. Kind of know me already. What did happen to the girl I live at CV with? When you got the call, you were still at CV with her? Yes? So that demon still. 99% <laughs> of women are demon. All right, so then when you're still there, you got the call. You never bother going at the work. You just get to the interview. You got the job. Um, so you're back at the WAF. The wharf, no, and You're then, in a better position, no. And then a couple months after that, we'd end up back. Go back home, went back to my aunt and my grandmother's house. So a couple months after that, you're on a demon girl. Then. <laughs> oh, go back, go back, uh, so she gave a bun, basically. Yeah. All right. That is our next term. <laughs> <right now. laughs> Listen to one. That is a whole podcast. That is a whole podcast yeah, itself. Yeah, <laughs> I know why if we go to Nino's history of dating, but <laughs> 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 you've made some wrong choices, sir. Um, so then... You're back at the wharf. You're in a better position. Yeah. Uh, what year was this? Back at the wharf, 2010. I can never forget. 2010, that. so that's 11 January years ago. January 2010, I started working at the shipping association of Jamaica. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then uh, how yeah, long you, you were there know. for? That's the longest work I've had in my life. I was out there for about five years. Five years. All right, and so then... me left. <laughs> just saying you, you left after events. Cool? I started keep signs. I'm still at work there and thing. And even them tell me I keep signs. People say, yo... <laughs> Like, next thing to you, you have to just, when I do things, they have to stay in a year and I move by a year pace. Like, I'm start work out, but they are walk from here, work and sand start keep now. So, I don't know, sand start keep. People start knowing, you know, like, put face to name and Money plus like. a bag of controversy. Like them there. People, people know who Nino is, them time, isn't it? A bag of things, a bag so of So, like, <laughs> like, you know, some point of bus, I got a wreck, and you like, people that say, yo, that one next sand and thing, and really, and don't know, when I put on them black, oh, what? Big part and and I I take both. Both so while you were doing sons, um, 
at a point you were still working and then you were also still taking the bus. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I could have taken go up. I have a nice paying job. I could have taken a loan from like the bank. My bank and get, get a like, car. Whatever year it was, that 2015, I could have paid good. So, so then you think that, is it because a lot of us have pride? And I can say that I'm a very prideful person. You understand? And sometimes our pride, you know, um, you know takes takes the higher road mm -hmm. um, than our brain. Cool. So then you're keeping a party and to save face and to all of that. And because you can't, because I remember the post and I remember all of that. And, you know, mm -hmm. people have said this and said that this is now a successful party. At that moment, it was in the top three tier of events. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, millions, you know, in your events and all of Just that. Just go the first, January 1st. Of a sugar man with ram, ram, right. ram, ram, ram. Is it me? So you could have the great car, but then... Could have buy a, could have gross buy a car when it makes like a... Could have buy a, like a, a civic car. I think I don't even knew. Just like to a, please people than to please yourself. Yeah, but me I say any day, me know me don't want and that never makes sense to me yet. Is yeah. It? So you never buy a car. Never um, buy a car yet. What year into doing sons you left your job at Dwarf? In the second year? Second year. Yeah, second year. Second year. And I mean, during this time as well, it wasn't just Sands. Uh, the, Sunshine well, was still going on? No. no Sunshine Sunshine stopped. Stopped. But what did it start? Um, it's a funny thing. When we work a while, like, we used to get paid every Thursday. <laughs> right? And the opportunity to come for a keep a series in a triple century every Thursday, which is triple Thursday. Right. <laughs> I would start, dude, I'm going to come to my left to work. I'm going to say, yo, the opportunity to come. I'm going to say, yo, I'm going to have to do this. And funny enough, I started to do that. And like, yeah, money after people we keep party, money after making a party. It's mm. a party me I keep. So because I keep and I go on good. My days and this strong bad same way, but anyway, mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. First, so because about five people come. <laughs> 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 I say, I want it. Cause them tell it was a free coming in and it was like we are trying to do this inclusive premium thing. Like we are saying, yo, it was like one five or two grand come liquor free. But then at that time, Sons was at the pinnacle. Sons right? big, but that doesn't mean. So then. You did the first party though, you know. You did triple Thursdays, right? And yeah. it never translate into because I would assume I'm not gonna I would assume in your mind it's off a shot because I'm shot because we keep saying yeah. I mean I got every some people are most far out. Right. So when you do it now and that never happened like but when you did it. And a promoter um, but um five other people come. And then like <laughs> I said, John, you know what is, isn't it? Yeah. They would don't know we do this. We have to analyze the situation. I say, yo. People now want to come to Triple Century every Thursday, every day, and you let them not pay. They must not want to come in and mm. let them. And I say, you know, say, I recover charging people that I nah, fuck with, especially as a weekly thing. If you go uptown Mondays or wherever they keep, more eat, most of them places are like five days the most, and all of them are yeah. free. But the deal we have with the club at the time, the club doesn't want to give it, like, bar and gate. So it have to be, I think, where the gate have to, where them say, here I go on. Let's do it. I'll come to a percentage, bar and gate, whatever I make, we get a percentage of the night. And that was the best thing ever happened. So come so boom now say no cover charge. You know, mm. let's follow you know, come shell in our shell. Mm. That, I know I saw people stay, our culture, our crowd stay. I know but that. I, I could have 20 in the morning, 23 don't get, don't pass, can I come shell? You know, promote is the most stressful thing, man. I tell you. All right, so then you started to keep triple, triple Thursdays. Thursday, and and that, it, so, that that, so that replaced the Thursday salary from what I do a walk. Mm. You see me? I mean, I do this. And like, but they even stop, like, I walk, walk off a contract thing. I like, get, I have to go to work every day if you know what. He used to call. You call a number and it assign you a job when you want a job every day. Oh, okay. So like, so about a year ad. But I, for the, the year before I resign, like in a one month, I'm going to work like four times for a month. Mm. <laughs> to get a job in a meeting. And I say, I don't need this work. I every day I go up on scan page, I say, I don't need an album. And he's mm. not coming to work. So I <laughs> I'm saying, he said to me as a joke because the manager for the company. And I start messing to me and say, you know, so the money I write for you. Mm. See me? When then, you made that decision though to leave, but, you know, although you were making money. It was a very big decision. It was, but It was because you were still balancing both of them. I made the, the need and it's leaving a sure pay. Like everybody that said, I got a sure pay, whatever, 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 whatever. But Tom, that is not, I'm not telling anybody to leave them job. Uh, don't. You, you don't, maybe not have the drive or maybe have the confidence or don't have the patience <laughs> or the faith mm -hmm. as me or anybody as I say doing entrepreneurship. Mm -hmm. But being how I am, the harder life gets on me, is the more me work. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you see me? So when, you, so when I when I stop working, that only make that only put the drive in on me for make sure for proof. Everybody who does it don't only for mm -hmm. work wrong. Plus, make sure I maintain 
can do everything. Because I, for me, left my people them house. I have mm. never called them once and say, yo, my need, mommy and daddy, me need this. Mommy and daddy, me need, all of me are dead. They never know yet. So you were, did you have moments whilst um, you left WAF, you know, and you did say that WAF paid mm -hmm. well. We all know this. Mm -hmm. WAF paying well, you're doing events now. Um, in the earlier part of your career, it did rough. you have moments where when, financially... Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, keep sons, as people would have said. Yeah, but sons are every day. Yeah. <laughs> no matter how, if you use, no matter how much more money you make, the lifestyle has got change. If before I used to eat chicken one time for the week, I set up tin mackerel or a chicken back, when you start earning more money, you start eating chicken five days a week. Which I've every day, the and more and you're, the exactly, like the more you're, you're earning is the more your expenses get Go. cool yeah. because at the end of the day, here we go now. If me used to work two thousand dollars, I make that two thousand dollars work. You know what I'm yeah. If me you now I make ten thousand dollars, I no longer want to take the bus. No I more. Want to take a taxi. Then you have to start a taxi. Go half a cheese set up yeah. the bus. You understand? So then there were moments even when you were doing sands and doing other doing events. Doing sands and doing things. Hard. You have time where it never it's kind of compared to where I come from, but it never all uh, the glory and. What well, no people might think, but any day I got shown about that, and any day I know say yo, it might don't know, but things are gonna balance back. Um, at what year in doing sands and all the wally for other events they would keep? At what year did you realize that yo, this makes because sometimes while you're in the moment, it not really resonate at the same time. Mm -hmm. But you know, as I say, there were struggling moments. But at what period now you say? Oh my God, I'm really and truly financially okay. Like Good. I can manage myself. I can buy myself a car now. You know, while well, I live uptown and all these things. You know, <laughs> <laughs> uh, what year that happened? Mm, about three years in keeping events. As in real, as in the first big event with us here, Sands and everything else, I think is because it's keep Sands. Like the over, so the estate, all that come after Sands. So for mm. myself, three years in, it's three years after keeping Sands, then... Mm -hmm. I kind of realized, say, yo, by then, no, I start other things like, isn't it? Invest money in other things other than event and money I turn this up. Mm. Money I turn this up. So, I mean, I rely upon party again. Alone, it's just that party I really do. I love. Okay. Um, you've had great events abroad, mm -hmm. especially with Sands. But with every stage in of Sands, and I said this to my virgin, Shav, um, you know, anybody know me, you know, Shav or my brother. And, you know, everybody know me, know that, you know, Kingston Fire was a great event. Mm -hmm. um, but I knew, I, I remember all the struggles that went into it. Party supposed to start at 9 o'clock, party now started at 11 o'clock yes. because of other factors. Um, every time you do a party, a, fire, a sun's a fire, something happens. Bruh, um, sun's a fire yeah. is like, if people will say, whatever, say, if we should vlog, like, you if should. we have somebody that walk with with a camera, people that... It's a bit the number one series for Netflix, the number one show for watch for Netflix. Like, it has a, like the first time we got in New York God. of a venue and every single thing, you know. And the day before, like, the day before the event, like a couple hours before the event and the night, the man said, oh, What did it happen? You don't remember, long as I lose the venue. Zin? <laughs> and that was a big thing as well. It's like yeah. eight. Eight hours till the next day. That was a big thing, Pastor. So people don't drive. Don't you know? Oh, yeah. Yeah, man. Remember. We drive go. We are the Hamptons. The Hamptons. The Hamptons. Town. The Hamptons and the man them find a new venue and like. How long we post on the sand space? Say, yo, this is where sand's keeping tomorrow at the Hamptons. It still never sign off on and say, yo. Only get two for two, but we say, yo, we have this trying. half away. Yeah. Cause they can't, we not left until. The man them said, they not left until. This man sign up on this, you see me? Anyway, boom. Keep. Sans got you at Hamptons. Perfect. And even, don't work, we still got to even like the last Florida. For but those before the last Florida the though, even the Florida thing, uh, before the Florida thing, you guys had an event in Canada. Uh -huh. um, what happened with that? Because I know that, you know, there were rumors about gunshot and war and... The shot never fire. Fuckery. Fight broke. Like, yeah, to, yeah. go back again with people and ego like, me table did finish like like China people them come out so there's a whole heap of crowd more than we the expect anyway table finished this your table them finish so like, like, man want that table, so like me that's a yo carry that's a yo yo my brother I can't rest my lick up on your table they tell me no for whatever reason they tell me no so I'm so cool yeah my friend them stand up here so and then we put a whole lick of foot 
You who tell me no, I walk past, kick up, kick up, like a by accident. You know me, don't be expert. Can you tell me no, from the guy? So the two already. man, them get up in an argument. Yeah. Fight, broke, long and short, buckle, broke, buckle, man, lit man, in buckle. People start run. People be start run, baby. No fight, no, no shot, no fire. But that did happen, and mm-hmm. the fight broke, people, them scatter and blah, blah, blah. Next day, up on the news. Shots. And that made international news. Science is in trouble again. Right. And God shot, not no But before <laughs> even that, before even that, you know. Right. I worked at the airport, <laughs> right? If, if, if anybody know me, I, I won't speak about what company I worked for, but I worked at the airport. Mm-hmm. Cool. And um, neither of them knows that anything neither of them keep. I'm always there, but oh. that was a public holiday. Public holidays at the airport and my position that I had. You can't get that data off. So me that work, um, the number one airline at, at, at the Norman Manor International Airport, you know, we do have 300 and plus customers. We are good calls to say, the people them is going to be late. Anybody know about the airport? Once a plane is delayed, even for one minute, you have to pay airport authority thousands of US dollars, right? The airline. We get called and we say, everybody's stuck in the traffic because they cannot make it to the airport because there's an event. Me no say, I might go to the party. So my manager and everybody at the airport, clearly they might have vexed them. I say, yo, scale this thing, every and blah, lose things. The flight was delayed for about five hours, by the way. I left work at 2 a.m. in the morning, thanks to Nino <laughs> and my other friends that keep sons. They get overtime, man. <laughs> <laughs> they get overtime. Brother, that made international news. No. Every politician was speaking about that. They never want granted no more permits. I could not pay for that promotion that they gave us. <laughs> that, really, that is the thing we never understood. It was really promotion. Like, yeah, but throughout all these adversities, though, um, throughout... You guys losing a venue throughout the Canada one making international news throughout, you know, the airport, the airport one news. that was very big. And everybody that's only can never get another permit again in Jamaica. The reason why you push through because we never do nothing wrong. Like, why were they asked me for do to make the event can keep by the airport? We did so. Whatever happened, I know people in the doors and nobody ever really talk about this. Exactly. That, that, was sec- that was a second. That was a That was a second year. We keeping at the third. That was a third year. Third year. Third year keeping at that same location, mm-hmm. right? And the airport road. This up. A JUTC bus it broke down in a one entire lane. We were pulled over to the south shore and it was in the lane. You get me? So that in the lane, it caused traffic by itself. And then the high volume of people, volume of people coming right. and the bus is right there. It caused the traffic for backup also. And then people to the patrons them. That no for them to should park on the south so them should have go to the designated parking area. No for them never did that listen. You know Jamaican people. You see, but if the bus was in one of the lane state, it would have easy. It would have smoother. It would have moved smoother and that would have um, that, that the only thing I'm saying I'm different from the years before where they are keeping it. Right. Um so then even the last sons, you know, you guys had you know an incident, you know, as they say in Florida. Mm-hmm. You lost a venue literally a couple of hours. Why before. the venue is why the party doing the starting hour? Right. Starting time. Be a member. Um and you guys pull through, right? Pull through, switch to our next No, video. I said this Crazy. to, again, Shav, and I said, brother, you know, every event is a group of people. It's not just you alone. Cool? However, me not like, if I did me, <laughs> it like you. me, maybe in the moment, would I just say, yo, this is too much? I can't bother with this. Because then it's not just you guys can't deal. Because when I keep partying, you know, people don't understand it. It's not just about the money also. I love to see people enjoying themselves. Exactly. And that's why I do this show. If I keep an event, I'm going I'm to I'm feel like my yeah, shot to enjoy when I get the XP. I'm going to feel bad. I want to see I enjoy myself. So bad when you see everybody know I come in and I say, oh, no, I always do this. I always problem. Even people when I have a ticket for combo. You know, Jamaican people love being negative. Mm-hmm. At any point in your, um, throughout all of, all of the fuck they want to go through, have you ever said to yourself that, yo, this is too much for me to handle? Um, how you push on? How you continue having faith? I just love, you know, I don't know, I just love, I love the sound speech and them. Like, like the bad one who come in, can I got tell them about, me you know, you know, you know, people, them sons this way, but you see, when them come through the gate and them come in at that venue there and mm. them enjoy themselves, none of them don't remember nothing them did I say before. Right. <laughs> them just come in and them enjoy themselves and say, yo, sons are the best part of the game. Fuck, again. fuck. But, but honestly, but for the thing them, them have understood. It's like when if most people who have sense with understand, like say, yo, sans jar, the magnitude of people are sans jar. It's mm. it really difficult for really execute all you want it all the time because it's easier in Jamaica, our place. We know who for go, we know for do the thing. But like right, in America, yeah, right. the reason why we even lose that venue is stupid. It's mm-hmm. no reason that the venue set up, stage, cabana, everything drop. Mm-hmm. 
we'll see, I could pay for that same year. And you were still following all protocols that they've been here. Everything. But right. they come, and I don't know what they have. I swear, to, I, it's too, we still don't understand why. The, the owner that's come and say, yo, police, I say, wait, wait, wait. I was like, what? I have a theory for that, but we're not going to tell you. And then, yeah, me have yeah. a theory, but we can't talk about yeah. the theory. Um, but Long and short, we get for, we pull the through. for no reason. When we pull through. We pull, we pull through and... Sans let us, let us go into teamwork. Cool? Mm-hmm. A lot of times, we have teams of persons that we're working with. Everybody wants me to start. So, mm-hmm. we would say that you're the face of TNS, your face of Sons, all that. But everybody in our Sons, and I was talking to somebody about this that don't understand event keeping. I mean, I tell him, you know, how many persons are involved. Cool? And I'm like, what I need all over now? And I say, yeah, but let me tell you this. Everybody that is involved in that yeah, team role. plays such a vital role. Like yeah. I have a man that knows about communication and marketing and have connections and can speak as it relates to meetings and proposals. Mm-hmm. They have a next man now. We might have a link of fire and we can say, yo, we can do this. Um, talk about team and ego. Because ego can mash up a lot of things. I've seen a lot of businesses and I won't speak about my personal experiences. But enough things mash up because of ego and, you know, but we know one person and say, yo, you're going like a year alone and do this, you're alone and do that. And it's a whole team. I get all the time. I get, yeah. I get enough time. I'm going to suck your mother. All <laughs> that, you know? But at the end of the day, for all that we know, is that the end mission is bigger than anyone away, isn't me? So, no matter how we get vexed, a couple of weeks or a couple of days after, mm. we're good. Mm. Because at the end of the day, we're not going to... You know, I don't know. I just, all of we kind of have the same, similar mind with the... Ambition we want all of our all our way up. So we know so no matter how you might not agree with something at the moment. It's like a pay off. It's like a pay off or you just know so yo, it's like a work. So it makes sense you get in your fees and yo, mm. me don't want to do this no more. No man I ever said that in a size team. So yo, me don't want to do this somewhere. Mm. Yo, me not deal with Nino again or me not deal. Yeah, that never ever happen. All of we might vex in at the moment, but we are always pull through, we're always good. Is it me? Because we know so at the end of the day. If me make a decision for something or I want to do something, it's must be because me believe in it. So, yo, it's going to be good for the end right. of everybody on the team. Isn't um, it? No, you've been in a lot of relationships. Martin, hold on, my God, because 20 minutes, eh? I want me to go over this a little bit. <laughs> you've, you've been in a lot of relationships. Yeah, really I want to start a job. I can give you a good thing for job next week. You know, but, oh, this is our job Sunday. But therefore, next week, Sunday? Sunday, I followed this. Ah, wow. You can't, 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 can't use it. <laughs> what, what? Because unless we get the flyer proposed first, we're going to do um So, Nino has been in a lot of public relationships like myself. Mm-hmm. But you know, I'm stop the relationships thing now because yeah, it never work out yet and, and toxic, bud. Uh, do you think, big up Shanzi, by the way, do you <laughs> think that. We got Shanzi anyway, she did. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> no, she, she almost did. What do you mean? Uh, um, how long you guys been together? Three years? Yeah. Do you think that. Because I'm not going to say that, you know, she is the reason why you're here, right? Mm-hmm. But do you think relationships and your relationship with Shanzi, because she's so goal-oriented as well, she keep you level-headed? Like, she also adds on to, because you already had the drive, but, you know, sometimes I want a woman to say, yo, she don't do more, this. She keep my focus. Right. You think that's it's important? Like, it's very important. Like, when... Of course, I don't know before Shanzi man, why I learned a baga baga thing would be a different guy, but even when me and I just started acting, it wasn't like I was, I became Saint Nino over the whole no, yeah. You see me? But like, like, when you don't really put things, that's you're not really, 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 you're not you know, you have to put a relationship so you keep you more focused on the mm-hmm. things like what you even know, even what they may talk to her. I mean, as I say, you know, say, oh, it's like it's so strange and we're like, yeah, as it is right now, but they ever, ever, they ever have, if me, if me ever vex, I even caught it for me, they even know who the fuck me the message first right now. I say, mm. oh, yo, be you are going. But they have a runner up. Yeah. <laughs> I know about it for the run up. It's me for yeah. message. Because I'm so focused on like just Building personal her. growth and mm-hmm. what we want to do right now. That never left on my mind. I love to talk I'm about it. I'm happy. And she didn't give me nothing. She didn't give me nothing for make me feel like, so yo, watch off a side there. I, 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 I mean, I feel, so I'm going to tell that person, so yo, because you're in a relationship, because maybe who you're there with, you know, give you that confidence, you're not know, really mm. pretty, certain things are, you see me? You mentioned personal growth. Um, you've also mentioned that your mindset has changed, and I've seen you've said this on your Instagram a lot of times. Your mindset changed, and you've, 
you're more into books and you know edifying edifying and educating yourself and you know just be a better person do you think that with growth your interests kind of shift us a little bit shift yeah and even like the same book them i'm gonna read like like one of which one of them one of them they listen and like that they say like most men you start to the thirties like that when most men start touching real stride because things are youth when you're younger when you some pre like mm. the flashiness and the girl mm. thing when you reach a certain that's the age you know you're like them people be focused on work. You see me like you only realize yo the need for the foundation them have for like third you know yeah. and like I've set the for certain foundation right now so reading and listening to them audio books. It really helps because things I might believe in, huh, it can't frame them. Mm. Drive where you used to have, it make it start move faster because you start to so hear, like, you start hear the story of them, like, I'm not listening. I don't like me not enough. I'm not reading enough fantasy book on them fuckers. Like, Same. It's like, yeah, anything these, motivational, like, this is motivational, boost it, yeah. motivational, like, things to make them know, I'm aligned to what I want to know mm. about. You get me? So it kind of make me move more focused and make me move more. Move better with everything, like have a more open mind with certain things, mm-hmm. like yeah, like when I close down, close my mind, I say, yeah, I can't do nothing. Like as it is right, I'm telling me I can't do anything. So I know a lot of times with with growth comes with a lot of um, your mindset change, your interest change, your your outlook in life changes. When I say you're not going to go out same way, but maybe not going to go out as much as well. Like sometimes you just want to home and relax. Um, what about do you think that with growth also you have to shed some people and you have to shed because maybe they want to bring you back into the lifestyle that that you don't want to go back in like is that important it's important because i got people you come out you kind of have friends in and you're bridging mm-hmm. bridging you grow up with that whatever but it's always negative because i'm personality i don't know whatever reason might it might stay like that though i'm not trying to stop talk to your friend I always keep a friend see me. But limit. But that person not the person you spend majority of your time with. Mm. Because if he's always negative, you're gonna be a negative person. Fuck. Like, I'm gonna if him always now pre grow time, now pre things of interest or you know say yo a better for you in a in the sense you yeah, in other circle because there's no rich friend, no rich nobody who you know rich have a friend for years and him still poor around him. Right. Fuck. Anybody who rich is not because of the rich keep rich friend. Most times, you never know if enough of them might never reach before, but him learn from him rich friend and mm. end up in the same thing. Motivate rich yourself, friend, right. Isn't it? Because him starts to things different. Mm. Because even all me to think about life and business before we start keep the very first time. That is not the thought I have in mind. Mm. I'm nowhere that person, same person, nowhere at all. Right. Isn't it? But really, enough people like I always find a negative in a something before them do it. Facts. Before them say, yo, oh, I can't do it. It's like, you find a million reasons why you're not going to do it. Mm. Then, oh, you're going to do it. If you even tell yourself, say, you're going to do it, but you think about the, 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 the reason why you're not supposed to do it, but mm-hmm. you say, yo, may I try? It's not going to work out. It's not going to work. Because you even go in a business store, you might have a genius idea in your mind, you know, and you're going to go, may I do this? And mm-hmm. you post and you spend like a lot. You spend like a 500,000 to do the idea. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You don't want to make back, a, you don't want to make back 50 grand out of the 500 mm-hmm. to do. The idea is a good idea, but maybe you might never execute it good to start it, right? But if you did negative before, when you lose that 500,000, you're not going to try to get in. True. Because you don't believe in your back of your mind. So, yo, see? It's not going to work. See, me tell it's not going to work. You're going to scan for me. You're going to fire my job because you're going to say, because we can't bother this over here. So. But no, if you tell yourself, you're going to analyze, so, yo, you know that you believe so this is a good idea. Mm. You see me? When it don't work out, you go instead of saying it's a fucking idea, you go analyze yo, why it, it never, never work out. I can change it. It's supposed to work out. I know I can change it. So, what me never do wrong? All right, we never come back carrying bad podcasts so you have almost different views for, mm. for, for I like my pro, I like my product. But just do think me go open the shop and, and people will come. Yeah, no, yeah, you see yeah. me? never link two influencers over there. So they will put up a billboard at half a tree. Yeah. All right, so here I go on. They spend too much money on products buying alone. So I should have spent 200000 And then spend 200000 right. upon advertising so people know about it. You get me? I say, so you go again, you see what I got 500000 again, and you go in again, mm. and it worked. But you have to have the faith and you have to know, say, yo, 
you believe in what you do, and not because it might fail the first time, mm -hmm. you got things say yo, he's a loser, a right? mm. fuck me, I do. Right. Nah, no, and I say it, you see me. Um, so two more questions, because we're gonna wrap up. Um, what, what would your thirty plus? <laughs> when I got share it, <laughs> what would thirty plus Nino tells thirty year old Nino, and also? 20 year old Nina, even. Mm -hmm. um, and what also would you change, if anything? Honestly, what you would if I had chip, or more to change it. Facts. If you think, if, but me know what the arch for me go to is make my purse, make me be the purse for me is right. Mm. I don't know if maybe I'd have a life easier with that. I'm not saying maybe I would have this drive, but I know if you fuck. <laughs> so the art from my go to and the lessons that I learned mm -hmm. are the reason why we're there as so today. I mean, would have, in every aspect, even 20 year old, Nina, 20 younger 20s, Nina, older 20s, Nina, when I do bag a girl thing, that I'm a person who believes that everybody, if you're single, when you're single, if you live your best life, don't care what nobody wants to eh? say. You, you don't have want, to tell me twice, you, you know this. Have, <laughs> ten, if you want to have 10 girls, yeah. or a girl want to have 10 men, yeah. live your best life. Yeah. So when you come to the time when you want to suck along, you mm. don't feel like you're miss up on nothing. But nothing, right. As it is right now, me no feel like me miss up on nothing. See, Especially in the social media, it's like every scroll, every scroll is a hot girl. Fucks. So, if you know, think you get it out of your system, you're going to say, oh, when I go feel like, I know some, as it is right now, I know some get a, if I get a girl, I have a chance to stop talking, I'm going to a girl. By the two, first three months, I see a girl who think think other than this girl. Mm, mm, <laughs> you see me? Mm. But kind of day, it, that, you realize now, so it's more than just looks. You right. see me? And see them in business too. And for this, I tell 20 year old Nina still, if I could, I would have all the time, the only thing, maybe I would have, Give myself better advice, start spending money on fuck. <laughs> same, and, same here. Start spending money on fuck and use the money there for try the one we had to know, for Facts. try to reach, great, reach greatness. But anything I listen still, that is life and lesson still. If you learn from your mistake, them, because I don't want them to know to have to make mistake. You can't, you me, you can, me you can't tell you to carry if you drop this, I got broke it, but you're not going to believe until you drop yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. It. Fucks. So um, when you drop it and broke it for yourself, you say, fuck, I should drop it for you. Do you think that? Promotion and doing events is what you'll be doing five years from now. Not alone. I Not think, alone. I think I will still be keeping. I love. Let like me tell you, I love keep party. Mm. Nothing to me like I go up and see the crowd of people. Stand up on the stage and, and I look, look down and I say, say everybody trust yeah, me. enjoy themselves. Yeah, man. Them time they all say, "Yo, I'm me do this. I'm, like me and my team do this. Like this is what we really produce." Oh, Best feeling. We sit and I say, "Yo, team, they are gonna like even now through this whole COVID thing. I can't eat no more." I look on it. I, I yesterday, yesterday before it's much to see him. Airport black kid video, and I said, Oh, people on the road, and I said, It's a clown. Yeah, one. You see me? Mm -hmm. But, um, let me change that. <laughs> yeah. You would be, do, you'll be doing it with that team. Doing, same I'll be doing it, but just like out avenues, I'm doing branch off and I already different thing. I want to have more, I want to have other business, especially in this COVID thing. You realize it. Yeah, if me, if, I, if you stay there, I realize I'm parties alone. I don't know. What, I don't know what will be if, happening. If I never have this show, I I come my party life with done. I'm mean, gonna work again. Um, but this, I think, this, as I'm telling you, people do now. This COVID thing, you find, you find yourself, I find a next level of you. Mm -hmm. uh, you're dead for hungry. True. You have to. You have to decide. Because even in this COVID thing, I think what you have to know is the growth. Mm -hmm. And this is the opposite too. For me. Make sure something I said is from a company. This program. <laughs> want me notice with you and why the girl to for you start this. You get thanks for everything where you, where you mm. come to see you do. Enough people pray for things. And when you get it, you still a company because something is going to go wrong. You don't realize, yo, what you really want it to do, you know. I'm going to get it now. Right. But you're so caught up on always complaining. But what you want, you don't realize the blessing where you have yep, now. True that. But every single thing I see you do, I say, Thank God. Mm. It's a good habit. I always recognize where you have mm -hmm. and focus more on what you have. But God, we really want to reach this. Up. But God, I'm there so now. I mm -hmm. really appreciate Trust it. Me. Don't take me take for granted. Not because you, you want more, I mean, I'm grateful. God just wants you want more, but you're grateful for God. You're grateful for what you have right now. now. Mm -hmm. A message. Okay. Okay. Um, tell us where we can follow you again. And also, um, do you have anything planned? You know, what's next? If you don't even want to tell me, especially, you know, 
to the T, specifically what's happening, but um, do you have anything planned? What's next for Nino and Sons and all your other events? Sons. Let's see go off of Florida. In April. Right. Um, what's happening with Sons? Where next? Sons, I keep again Memorial Weekend in Florida. As we always, as we always do every year, except last year because COVID, but it's yeah, things different than Florida now. And then COVID down there, Florida. Something big I got happen mm. this summer. Mm -hmm. Him tell him by the way, but we can't because the episode I got come out before them actually yeah. announce it. We can't, but we tell you something. It, it shall reach it next, next, the yeah. following Sunday. But I'm telling you, like it, 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 it's something when we know said did I got happen for a long time or I want it to happen a long time, but I'm glad that it's actually happening. So big and, up to you. And this is why COVID is like yeah. a blessing. Because if it wasn't COVID, I don't think we even reached that frame of mind. Right. But it's really put a growth in and you're like, you have to level up. Fuck. So, uh, where we can follow you? Yeah. What one for your vlog to? What we can find the vlog them and the video them and thing. Come on, on the YouTube. San Zenino yeah. on YouTube. Yeah. Watch all yeah. the fuck you. San Zen put me to one hard. <laughs> <laughs> and on Instagram, Nino underscore TNS. Mm. You can follow me. Or the San Zen. San Zen. San Zen. ST Jamaica. Mm. Triple Thursdays. Mm. Over so. Sonic Couriers. <laughs> oh, yeah, Korea. big up Sonic Couriers. Sonic yeah. Couriers, my Courier company. Yeah, you see me. All right, Nina, well, respect for following you. We appreciate the story. Um, you know, guys, my always are telling you, listen, my always like, talk to my team all the time. Um, I've always said this on my radio show every Tuesday. You know, I when you hear a little tips on my story already, so I understand how I feel about this, you know, about drive and, you know, using your nose and the negatives to you know overcome and find your niche and find your purpose and your calling right um so i brought nino on for that same purpose because you know you may be seeing and be man things and uptown apartments and all these things <laughs> but you know understand that it, it actually took many many years to mm -hmm. get here right so even if it's a little promoter a little entrepreneur you may be thinking to yourself oh my can't reach this or yet not knowing that he went through maybe even more than what you are going through right now right um you know, and as Martin said to me, you know, adversity builds resilience. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I'm a testimony for that. And, you know, also, you know, um, I am nowhere close to where I want to be, but I know where I am going. And I know, Definitely. you know, a year ago where the mindset where I was, you know, we're almost at our one year anniversary, don't, don't it? Yeah. So we're almost at the one year anniversary for the podcast. And when we started the radio show, David, June, so a couple more months for the radio show. Um, yeah, and one year ago, I was just coming out of depression, and you know, understand, and my oh boy, three seasons deep. So, once again, you right with 16,000 subscribers, and what a video, but see, eh? our wild videos were reach all, all you know, 70,000 views and stuff. So, I mean, you know, and again, you're still going through things, you understand, like I still have challenges, and holy pass up with me, I got you right now. Wally past sleepless nights and tears and all these things, but you're grateful for what you have because this is what I prayed for last year, March, when COVID started. You understand me? Um, next week will be our season finale. Our guest should be. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, next week we'll have a season finale. And um, you know, thank you so much for the support. Remember, Vape Shop JA, all vaping, not just this one, every type of vape where you see. Vape Shop JA, remember, Catalyst Perfect 10. Med Spa. Oh, today's my mother's birthday, by the way. So, yeah, I was on a ship. We go up to my mother, right? True. Happy yeah. birthday, mommy. Yeah. <laughs> um, you know, thank you to my team, the Bombcast, Martin. Thank you, Davion, for being here. Catalyst Perfect 10 at uh, shop number 19 inside the Ligonier Post Mall. Tuesday for my radio show at um, Boy Things After Dark on New Start 93 FM, 8 to 11 p.m. Daylight savings time now. So, for the big foreign people, 9 to 12. You know what I mean? Follow me. Socials will be in the description box. And thank you for tuning in. He heard from the man himself, man walk, hand out resumes. He almost got robbed. He get fired how much time and start over how much time. B wicked girl, bunny man, all these things. <laughs> and he's here now doing well in a relationship uh, and it's also his life. Nino, I got publicly said this and I've said this to you many times. You don't know any time when I keep an event, let me tell you, though, any time Nino that I keep a party, Nino yeah. can know say, I got a message even upon the day and say, brother, good luck. Yeah. You understand? Fuck. And, you know, even after the party, I say, yo, you know, congrats. Because at the end of the day, as I say, celebrate your people. Like, we have to look out for each other. Fuck. Congratulate your people. Kind and, to one another. Yeah, man. Hard work and continue praying and having faith. Right? Manifest your whole life. If you want it, it will happen. If I'm Fuck. king boy of things himself, big up on yourself. You understand? You understand?